Good morning. Good Friday. I think today we're going to go to Magic Kingdom. Rumor is Halloween is slowly beginning. Some of the merchandise for this year's Halloween is out. Not sure about decorations in the park itself. I think that, if I'm correct, begins the first night of the Halloween party, but we shall see. I'm gonna take the bike today. There's a tropical wave, tropical storm, hurricane, something on the way to Florida. So we should be okay today. I have the rain jacket in here just in case, because I think with my luck, we will get rained on for sure. But let's go, hop on the bike, go to Magic Kingdom, see what they got going on. Thank you so much. All right, thank you, day. you too. The cool thing about taking a motorcycle to Magic Kingdom, if you've never done it, is you get the park in Princess Parking. In the very front of the parking lot, so you don't have to hop on the tram, you just walk right on in. And you get to see tourist driver stuff. Like, leaving your four-way flashers on. Make sure I got my keys, yeah, we're good on that. Leaving flashers on. These people left their entire car on. The motor is running. And if you come here enough, well, I mean, I used to work here, but if you come here enough, you see that stuff all the time. And it's, it never gets old. It looks like the, Monorails are down. So I guess we're taking the boat. When the monorail is down, that is a pain in the butt getting in the park. But alas, we are here. I haven't heard this song in years. So back when I used to work here, we had Mai Sai, which is the Move It, Shake It parade. It was like a dance party in the castle square circle. I didn't know they still had this song. Of course, they don't really do a dance party anymore because of COVID, but they still got the song. It brings back memories, I love it. By the way, if you're a parent with kids, keep them out of the goddamn street. Kid almost got hit. Jesus Christ. If you've never been to Magic Kingdom before and you want to be like one of the cool kids with the purple wall pictures that you always see on the internet, when you walk into Tomorrowland, look to your right, right by the Gold Stitch statue, right by Tomorrowland Terrace, you can be like the cool kids. You're welcome. All right, let's go check out the country bears. So just choose a row and, and sit your bare bottom down. <laughs> no, choose a row and slide all the way across. Just make sure you stop when you reach the end or you might be watching from the floor. 
Folks, welcome to the one and only original country band musical tambourine, featuring a wild and woolly assortment of grizzled old grizzlies singing a little country, a little western, and a whole lot of everything in between. Let's hear it for the five bear rocks! Hit it, boys! Trio, Bunny, Bubbles, and Beulah. Country bears. Ugh. We'll talk about that in a little bit. But for now, let's go over to Tom Sawyer's Island to escape the craziness. Because it is crazy over here. For anybody curious, these boats are on a track. So, in case you did not know. Well, come. If you've never been back here to Tom Sawyer's Island, it's a pretty cool little place. A lot of little trails. There's a, I think there's two caves or one cave that connects. Either way, it's fun. A nice little area to kind of get away from the craziness of all the people. So let's talk about the Country Bear musical Jamboree because apparently before with just Jamboree, it wasn't a musical, right? Did it have to be done? No. It's the whole thing where five people on Twitter get offended that a song has the word blood in it and another song, part of the lyrics are like, he turns me on, blah, blah, blah. Even though it's an old country song, no one was ever offended until five people with blank Twitter profiles got offended. The new songs are good. Um, if you don't know me personally, I am a tour bus driver and I'm a drummer. Um, over 20 years doing drums and I've been driving for eight, eight years, nine years. Um, drove bands such as Wednesday 13, Love, Don Broco, Glory Hammer, Evergrey, some more bands, probably can't remember off the top of my head. <laughs> But from someone in the music industry, what did I think of it? So the, you can tell it was recorded in Nashville. Sounds like everything out of Nashville in the past 20 years. So the songs are good. Um, other than that, it didn't have to be done. I mean, I get, I get it with how things progress and time changes, people get offended. And then Disney has to bend over to please them. So let's just take some old songs from Disney that are nice and harmless and safe and redo them with some singing bears. Hell yeah, so that's what it is. <laughs> so not much to it. So it was cool. Uh, would I do it again? No, it was a one and done. <laughs> but if you have kids that are in the Disney, they'll, they'll of course probably like it, but it was cool. All right, 
let's continue. If you come to Disney, do not do this. If his kid fell in the water, that's the same kind of person that would try to sue Disney because it's unsafe. Yeah. So I did join the virtual queue for Tiana's Bayou today because we haven't done it yet. Um, I was able to get in actually at like 1.06 uh, p.m. today. I got in, but we are, it's kind of bright. I'm group 147 and they're now boarding 46 to 57. So my estimate is that's going to be tonight. I don't know if I'm going to stay that long. Unless when Jackie gets off work, we come back up here, but we'll see. But it does sound nice because it is hot today. I'm tempted just to go to Typhoon Lagoon right now. <laughs> Still got the wall up at the gift shop for pirates where the toy guns were offensive and I had to get rid of them. I, don't, I, I think I went on this and I don't remember it being better. We still got the other wall covering out here. So there's your Pirates of the Caribbean update for today. Got the old Hawk Tua camel. It's a little hot. Look at some of the Halloween merchandise. I'm gonna make a, uh, a short with all the Halloween merch kind of collage together. So look out for that. Probably upload it at the same time as this video. So if you wanna see all the Halloween merch, check out that video. Um, it's hot, it's crowded. I'm hungry, so I think we're gonna leave. We might come back later tonight when she gets off work, but for now, we're gonna get the heck out of here. It sucks that the monorails aren't working. Cause I kinda wanted to take it to the Contemporary and get lunch, but maybe we'll go somewhere else. Like Wilderness Lodge, we haven't been there in forever, so let's do that. If you didn't know, you can actually pay to rent a pontoon boat for the day here on the lake and you can go fishing. The more you know, if you didn't know. Just arrived to Wilderness Lodge, my favorite resort here. Don't tell anybody, but years and years ago before they got super strict, me and my friends would come all the way here and we would go swimming. <laughs> back when no one really cared, but these days, can't do that. The music they're playing over there almost sounds like youth group inspirational music. There is a God. He loves you. You are forgiven for everything you've done. Never give up. It's great. All right, so we got food at the Roaring Fork. Chicken tenders and fries, easy peasy, a little Budweiser. Feeling the tipsiness, I think it's time to go back to magic because the radar looks suspicious, a little suspicious. The clouds are coming in, it's supposed to be horrible tonight, so my virtual queue, we're going to have to reschedule that and come another time. So straight ahead is the world famous Discovery Island, the abandoned water park of River Country. It's all still there. On the boat, headed back to Magic Kingdom, and then another boat to the Ticket Transportation Center. Rumor for the monorail being down is that it was struck by lightning last night. Ooh, feels awesome with the breeze. But now I'm going back into the sun, so lost a little bit of points there on how good it feels, but it still feels better than sitting inside in the hot box. I'll take the breeze over the hot box any day. So yeah, going back, get the boat, ticket transportation center, ticket transportation center. Can barely talk today. And then we're gonna go home because it's gonna storm. Got some suspicious clouds over there. You gotta get out of here. Clouds are coming in. 
I just checked the internet and apparently there's a heat advisory today, so that might explain a little bit. It's supposed to be like 107 today. Awesome. So, almost to the bike. Gonna hop on, gonna haul ass, gonna get home. Take a cold shower and then I'll catch up with you. Whew, that was a hot one. Definitely, I think, the hottest day of this summer, which is crazy, but that's coming from me, a natural born Floridian. So you can take my word for it. Very hot, I am crispy. Just got back from the neighborhood pool, which felt like a hot tub. So, cold shower, I think we're gonna do that. And then uh, chug down some ice water. <laughs> but yeah, if you watched the whole video, thunder. If you watched the whole video, thank you, as always. Um, thought about going back to the park tonight for the virtual queue for Tiana's, but between the heat and the crazy storm coming in the Florida this weekend, it's already happening now. We're just gonna, we'll wait to do Tiana's another time. It's not going anywhere. So yeah, watch the whole video. Thank you. As always, I appreciate it. We'll see you on the next one. Later.